Hey guys, this is just a quick video to show you guys a type of terminal that's uh, available on Linux Mint. It's called the Quake Terminal. Now of course you guys are already familiar with the regular terminal which you can receive or get from your applications menu. Just uh, standard bare bones stuff there. But uh, since I've already installed the Gweg terminal, I can hit the shortcut F12 and it pops up right there. So it's uh, really handy. It's uh, simple to use. It doesn't impede any of your work. So you can, you know, obviously you can see behind it. It comes from the top, which is quite helpful as well. And also, if we right click on it, we'll find that it's really fully customizable. Uh, in this case, I've punched up the, uh, the font there, the size, and made it a bit bold. Uh, I've also got the shortcut, as I just mentioned. So F12 keep that there so basically let's uh, hit F12 put it there F11 will make it full screen which is pretty cool as well and that's pretty much it guys so I'll show you how to install it, it only takes a second uh, ironically I suppose you've got to use the terminal as well so just uh, go to your terminal and type in the following sudo apt install gwake and that's pretty much all you need to do hit enter throw in your password and let that install. Of course mine's already installed so nothing extra to uh, perform, no buttons to click. Close that. Now what you might also want to do is set it in your startup applications for the next time you run Linux. So just type in startup or startup applications in your menu. Click on that one. Uh, click add down the bottom here, bottom left. You can choose custom command but just choose application as it is an application there and let's see go across to Gwake there we go we've got the preferences which you can uh, reach by right clicking on the terminal itself or we've got the Gwake terminal so I just click that add application and I've already got it in there so there's no point in having it twice but uh, there you go I'll just leave one on in fact I might even delete the other one but uh, that's pretty much it in a nutshell guys so that is how you, uh, you use this really cool and handy uh, Gwake terminal in Linux Mint hope you've enjoyed cheers